And on to the big corporate story, Tata Steel's own version of Brexit could get delayed. Even as the board meeting is underway in Mumbai today, we learn that Tata Steel may postpone the sale of its UK business. Kritika Saxena is here with the details. Kritika, the board meet is set to end any time now. What can we expect? Well, it's been a long one. The board uh, started to meet around 11.30 a.m. and they have been uh, discussing various uh, permutations and combinations on how they can uh, or what's the future course of action rather for the UK uh, business. But remember, before they started the board, meet uh, UK business secretary Sajid Javid was in Mumbai to meet Sarah Smith three and the top management of Tata Steel. After that meeting, in fact, around 2 p.m., he uh, tweeted saying that just finished the meeting with Tata Steel and he's now headed to Delhi uh, for meetings with the uh, uh, government officials. Now, specific to what we are expecting today, Two uh, specific outcomes can come out. One is the possibility of Tata Steel putting on hold its entire uh, UK operations. If you divide the UK operations, uh, the largest is Port Talbot, which has about 4,000 employees. Then there are uh, three other uh, crucial plants that are also likely to be with, uh, to be assessed independently and that includes Hartlepool, Rotherham and Stocksbridge. Now I understand that the management uh, and the board is currently evaluating uh, the bids that have come in for the entire business that is uh, from Liberty House and Escalibur Steel and looking at the kind of shortfall uh, the, that is the pension shortfall and the kind of losses that each of these plants uh, have been undergoing on a case-to-case -case basis. So various areas are looking being looked at. Um, there is a possibility that the may also look at shortlisting a bidder or making the bidders public but most media reports as well as what we picked up from our sources say that Tata Steel is most likely to put some or all of its UK business on hold at least for some time. Thank you so much.